these IP joysticks are really the, the full value of them are unlocked through the web interface. So they're powered over Ethernet. And once they're powered over Ethernet, we can connect to their IP address, which is shown on the top here, and we can go into the web interface to do even more. Does the web interface work on a Mac from Timothy? Yes, it will. Uh, the web interface will work with any web browser. So it will work for a Mac. Don't worry. We love Mac users out there. Uh, we have all of our, mo almost all of our apps, including the CMP mm -hmm. software, all work for Windows and Mac and Linux. So for those yeah. Linux users out there too. <laughs> um, with this web interface here, I just want to show the custom button area. Uh, there's a lot of cool areas to this joystick area. Uh, but one, actually, before I go to the custom button area, I just want to show, you can actually search your entire network and it will show all NDI sources. So that's really cool, not just because it makes adding cameras super easy, right? Any NDI camera, this PTZ, this will work with. But also, there's a tool called the NDI Bridge. Mm -hmm. And that bridges multiple networks together. So this allows you to control cameras that might not even be on your local area network, but on another local area network somewhere else in the world. That's an idea. And that's it, just the SuperJoy? Well, yes, it is actually just the SuperJoy because the SuperJoy supports NDI. Right. Uh, it can search the network for those NDI sources. So if you have a PT Joy G4, that's like the perfect opportunity. You have all these NDI devices. You want that easeability, that instant connection. Super Joy is perfect for that. Yep. So that's where this comes in. And you can just quickly add those. You know, so it also removes the need to know the IP address or, you know, it just makes things easier. Yeah. How many times have I heard, what's the IP address for that? Yes. <laughs> can you read that out for us? <laughs> We're constantly doing that. <laughs> now, this tab here is the custom button tab. And the custom buttons allow you to send HTTP triggers. You are TCP, UDP, and then, of course, super presets that we talked about. Now, I'll take a moment to explain super presets. Mm -hmm. And then uh, I got a great tutorial from Matt Davis, the engineer who designed the SuperJoy, who wanted to share how to do um, pan tilt limits with the SuperJoy, which is a great example. Of